Hey everyone, this is Renee from iMore.com and this is iOS 5.1. First things first, the iPhone gets a new way to quickly access the camera right from the lock screen. You simply touch the camera icon and slide up and there's the camera. From the camera app you can take pictures, access the camera roll, and if your iPhone isn't passcode locked, go right to the home screen. If you decide you don't want to take a picture, you can just swipe back down to return to the lock screen. You can also now delete photos from PhotoStream. You're welcome, Hollywood starlets. For iPhone 4S owners in Japan, Siri now supports Japanese. Just toggle it on in settings and away you go. Konnichiwa. For AT&T iPhone 4S users, the network indicator will now lie to you and call any old 3G signal you're lucky enough to grab 4G. Shameful. Apple has also removed URL string shortcuts, so you can no longer add icons to your home screen to toggle Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, brightness, etc. Hey everyone, this is Georgia from iMovie. For iPad users, podcasts now gain proper speed controls and a 30-second rewind button so you can re-listen to anything you might have missed. The camera app has also been redesigned with all the same familiar controls, but now in a better looking interface. While not unique to iOS 5.1, it's worth noting, just because of the timing, that the cellular data download limit has been raised from 20 megabytes to 50 megabytes. That's it. Small update this time. I'm Renee from iMore.com. <laughs>